Hey everybody, it's Mike. Part-time reselling in the Pittsburgh area, and I would say that a majority of the people who resell on eBay have a love-hate relationship with eBay. Maybe a hate-love would be a better way to put it. Uh, you love it because it gives you a place to sell things. You hate it because of some of the policies they come up with, and of course, uh, uh, the fees. This was a new one for me. This put me in the hate category. Uh, my notes are over here because I want to make sure I get everything right. Uh, I got an email uh, a week or so ago with the uh, subject, your listing was removed, product safety policy. Uh, I uh, open it up and they're talking about this listing where I'm trying to sell a Cuisinart blade, this one, uh, DLC 844 TX. Uh, in the email, they provide a link to the uh, U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission website. So I click on it and eBay has a totally wrong blade. This is the blade that is being recalled, not the one that I am listed. Uh, anybody can tell that there's a big difference between the two blades. Um, so I wasn't going to, uh, to do an appeal because I was thinking of, uh, taking the listing down anyway, because it really hasn't been getting much activity. But then I thought, you know what? I am going to do an appeal. Uh, number one reason, they're wrong and I'm right. Uh, number two reason, I don't know if they keep track of things like that, but I don't want it to be on my record that I had something pulled because of a safety concern. You figure they would keep track of that because they don't want a user to like constantly list stuff that's uh, not good, uh, that's been recalled. So you figure they are keeping track of that. And uh, the third reason, yeah, do a video and, and, and follow through to see exactly how the appeal process works. So uh, this morning, I did the appeal between 8 and 8.30, somewhere around there. I'm not really sure. Less than, I included photos of uh, the website uh, uh, showing that the, they got the wrong blade. And maybe 45 minutes later, I got a response. And they're like, oh, sorry, uh, appeal denied. Okay, now, uh, first of all, I know it's the wrong blade because this is the blade they're talking about. I have it <laughs> because I bought the Cuisinart that came with this blade to resell. And then when I tried to list it, I found out that this was being recalled. So I parted it out and that's why I have that other blade to resell because I had to part it out and I'm trying to sell the individual parts. So I know this blade has been recalled. That's why I'm not selling this blade. And if you do a search for the blade itself, you get, uh, what's at least here, 951 results. There's 951 listings for this blade or, you know, a package that includes that blade. And you can see the sold ones, there's 82 results of uh, somebody selling this blade. That's an awful lot of listings and sales for something that's been recalled. Uh, so anyway, very frustrating because it's something that, again, a company or a person had did something wrong and I had to take my time to try to straighten it out. And even though I took the time to straighten it out, uh, it, it, it still didn't work. So you see here the appeal, the email they got back. There's nothing for me to click. No way for me to follow up and say, you know, take a closer look. I highly doubt a person actually looked at this because anybody with a pulse can tell these are two different blades. Um, so I'm, uh, I guess I'm, I'm screwed. That's it. I can't do any more. Nobody looked at it. All right. It came back way too fast for somebody to actually look at it and say, well, yes, these two blades are different. We made a mistake. So anyway, that was the quick appeal process. I didn't think it was going to take just 45 minutes. Uh, eBay was wrong on this one, but there's nothing I can do about it. So I guess that's it. Uh, all right. Well, thanks for watching. <laughs> I appreciate it. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.